and two. All right, let's get going again. A slight case of space-time disorder. Uh, looks like I played an hour and 29 minutes last time. We got the level eight. Pretty awesome. Ow. That bat is very rude. Get away from me. Very rude bat. He makes some really crazy sounds. Alright, so this is turned into Metroid, I guess. What is that sound? with this experience. I want this coin. Oh no. Ah, I got the coin. Prost. Oh, I'm gonna get this coin too. Pro strats. That's how we do it. Oh, wait. I didn't think I could jump on these ladders before. I wonder if something changed. This guy is speedy. Look at him go. Oh boy. Yeah. Hit, hit, ha, hit, ha. Uh, don't die. Hit, hit, Am I supposed to go down here? Ah, treasure chest! Look at me go. I got a collectible star. Rock on, man. Hang on one second. Okay, I'm back. I wanna drown! I wanna drown! Good. Thank you. Goodness. That was scary. Oh yeah! Wee! Aw, want that experience. But I need to hurry. Oh my god. I really need to hurry. Ah, there we go. Level up. Oh my, uh... Alright, level 9. I only got health. I only got, uh, 4 hit points. What's that sound? Oh gosh, oh god. Oh, where's the air? Get out of here. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You got this. <laughs> that was a little bit difficult getting up there. Oh, oh. Oh no! Multitasking! Good job. Ow. Ow. Whee! Oh boy, where's the air? Where's the air? There's the air! Give me, give me that air! Delicious hit points. Thank you. Thank you, Hearts. Key to the sewers. That's two keys. I think that's all I need. Oh, hello, eye guy. Oh, yeah. 
Wow. He makes a very lazy attack, he just falls over. Hello. I like the same sound. Key to the sewers. Boom. Whoa. This door is closed. We need another key. It's always... What? what, what? Oh my. Ah! Finally we're in the open air. Mmm. It even smells like cake out here. Delicious. Come to think of it, I've hardly had a bite to eat since we started what was supposed to be a quick stroll. That cake smell makes my tummy rumble, Tycho. Aren't you hungry too? No. Not really. Die, die, die. You sure you're human? I too would be amenable to a little rest. But we should stay discreet. The city gates are closed due to the war. We shall have to devise a plan to get us out of this bind. Hey, cool dude, welcome back. Yeah, it is kind of Zelda-like, isn't it? Um, it started out, I guess, even more Zelda-like, but it's, uh, it's a pretty crazy game. And it would certainly be a good place to obtain information. My people are more at risk with each hour we waste. That settles it then. We're gonna eat. The body needs strength in order to fight. Man, this guy, he's smart. He knows. Can't you just say that you're hungry, cow? Dot, dot, dot. I, I am hungry. Ah, uh, there we go. You just have to be honest about your feelings in life. The green guy looks like Zelda. Oh, I guess so. It looks kind of like Link. Although, uh, I'm trying to remember what Zelda the princess looks like. Um, I don't remember, actually. But yeah. You just have to be honest about your feelings in life. Man, Rail is so smart. Immediately gets easier. We're going to continue this adventure together. We have to be honest with each other. Right, Tycho? Dot, dot, dot. I just dot, dot, dot everything, man. Let's go. Yeah. I'm hungry, Mega Clink. This guy doesn't know my real name, apparently. Cal just thinks it's Mega Clink. I've really fooled him pretty good. Let us gather our strength and find information. Can I kick this chicken? Ah. In any proper Zelda game, you should be able to kick the chicken. Or pick it up, or whatever it is he does. Okay, this village is kind of big, so let's go explore. I want some money. I know we don't have much money, but my mommy works hard to have enough to take me to the fights at the Coliseum. My mommy is super cool. Who's your favorite fighter? I'm so scared of Cal, the exterminator. I get nightmares sometimes. But don't tell my mommy, okay? She wouldn't want to take me to the Coliseum no more. Alright, buddy. I won't tell your mommy. Oops, almost attacked his mom. Sorry about that. My son just loves the Coliseum. I wish he was more interested in the hard facts of life. Like doing housework, kirking, cooking, working to survive. We will have time to learn about that when we all grown up. And Zelda, and Zelda, you could pick... Oh, that's right, yeah, you could pick the chicken up and throw them. I think you could, like, jump from a height? I seem to remember you could grab a chicken and then jump, and it would, like... It would flap its wings so you could sort of get to a really hard-to-reach spot. Something like that. You could use it to fly, kind of. Uh, that, that was pretty fun. Better let him dream for now. Oh, I was hoping to steal all these people's money. Where's where's their where's their money? They don't have any. Oh, hello. Ever since the war started, my brother has had malicious thoughts. I'm positive those wretched sorcerers are behind all this. Why did the emperor call on them to battle the demons? 
Colonel Dalkin and our soldiers could certainly deal with it by themselves. Hey, they should send the lieutenants too while they're at it. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. You would glide down slowly. I thought that was really fun. I can't do anything with that chicken though. He's boring. I want to pick up the chicken and fly. Oh, let's see. I guess this is an N. I hate my family. They're snobs who climb the social ladder on the back of big business. All they do is exploit people by stealing the added value of their hard labor. One day when I grow up, I'll be a rev revolutionary. Or maybe I'll travel around the world. I haven't really decided yet. Ethics, a matter of perspective by Professor Friedman. Honestly, Maria, I've told you a hundred times never to combine pink and blue sheets that way. My poor girl, you have no artistic sense about you. This is very upsetting. What in the world do you do all day besides housework? Better yourself, will you? Try immersing yourself in art. Although, I doubt you would be receptive to it. Wow, this lady. I just want to... Ugh, she's the worst. Some socks that smell awful ripe. Ugh. A set of bolts, nuts, screws, and diagrams for Ikeo furniture. Why on earth would they keep that stuff? I have a bunch of uh, extra furniture stuff laying around everywhere. So yeah, hundreds of plastic toys. What's the point? All you need is one game console. That... That's the truth. That's the truth. Oh, don't do it. Yes. Yeah. Oh, my God. oh wow, thanks for following, man. The Great Corn Holio. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. The missus is very demanding when it comes to collars. I admit I don't well understand what she wants. Surely it's because I don't know anything about art. Surely. Uh, did I check that chest over there? I feel like I did, but let's just double check it. Yay! I didn't check it. I got one gold. I'm rich. Better than nothing. You got that right. Eh. Get out of my way. I want that treasure chest. My mom and dad, they're really, really, really rich. That's awesome. That kind of makes me a princess, right? I'm going to ask for a pony for my birthday. And also, five new dolls. Oh, is it really cool, dude? Oh, that's pretty awesome. Thanks, man. <laughs> Building up my followers. Thanks, you. Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. Whenever I start crying, they give me whatever I want anyway. The Great Cornholio. Are you a uh, Beavis and Butthead fan? How to Spend Your Money When You Have Too Much by Bill G. He's got it all figured out. Good old Bill Gates. A lovely collection of bathrobes from a number of luxury hotels. A 64-piece tea set. Too expensive to use every day. It's brand new. Honestly, young man, I find it quite presumptuous of you to speak to me that way. Know that I am destined to inherit my parents' fortune. Therefore, I hardly have time to waste speaking with people of your ilk. Wow, some of the people in this in this city are pretty horrid. Oh yeah, so am I. I used to watch I used to watch them all the time. I love the uh, the music videos whenever they start commenting on them. At times, I wonder if being rich is not a kind of servitude. In any case, it brings me many woes. Would I make the same choices if I had to do it all over again? Well, I would certainly correct some mistakes. Dot, dot, dot. I would no doubt be even richer then. How to get richer by making other people poorer <laughs> by Morstan Gamley. For real? That's probably a real book somewhere. <laughs> TP from my bang hole. Great Cornholio. Blah. Move along, the city gates are closed until further notice. Uh, <laughs> closed. Move along. Okay. Hey, what's this guy want? What's up? Ever since the war started, my. Oh, I already talked to this guy. Yeah, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Is this different? Certainly deal with it by themselves. 
Oh yeah, I did read that. Yep, I remember the lieutenant's part. Be a millionaire, play and win. Open 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. Is there actually time in this game? Like I don't see. I see a play time, but not like a, you know, however long. Chickens, chickens. Get the chickens. My chickens ran away, and now they've strayed all across the city. What? You want to help me round them up? Oh, this was a quest in, um... This was a quest in Zelda, wasn't it? Where you have to help them gather up all the... Gather up all the chickens. I remember this now. Have you thought about getting a moderator? Uh, I haven't thought about it yet. Um, I don't really have that many people. I know, like, once... You know, once, I guess, more people are in here, and it's... You know, it's, it's busier. I'll definitely need to think about that, man. But yeah, I'll uh, I'll definitely have to consider it someday. I'm gonna say n yes. I wonder if I can actually help them round these up. No way. <laughs> Last time I did that, I trusted a kid all dressed in green who just screwed around. Yeah, they're totally making a Zelda joke. That's funny. I like this. Even use my chickens to fly off the ground. <gasps> a bunch of nonsense, really. My poor hens were traumatized for weeks. I'll take care of this myself. <laughs> That's pretty funny, they made a Zelda joke. Oh, this game. Can I go through here? No, okay. So I can't actually leave. My fiance went off to Main Bridge to fight those awful demons. I'm so worried about him. What if he comes back disfigured with a scar across his beautiful face? Yeah, that does sound like Zelda. That was pretty funny. I like that whole exchange. Today's menu. Starter. Crunchy salad topped with six-legged critters. Main dish. Small rat. Stewed in its own dubious juices. Dessert. Cook. Hair. Pie. Today's special beef cartilage. Big walk with a side of rot-proof fries. Enjoy your meal. Eww. That sounds disgusting. Welcome to Walk Donald's. Oh my god. Walk Donald's. We haven't started super food yet. Stop by later. Okay. In the meantime, I'm going to try to rob you. Uh, there's nothing here to rob. Oh well. Maybe next time I'll stop by Walk Donald's. I don't know why, but you sound a lot like my teacher. For real. I'm not a teacher. I've never taught. I'm not that intelligent. What, uh, I guess, what does that teacher do? Are you, uh, currently in school? I'm so proud of my little Dawkin. He always had such a keen sense of justice. And now he's an important man. I just hope war doesn't change him, and that he'll always be my sweet little boy. Well, hopefully. I don't know. Five gold! Yeah! Or actually, do I sound like your teacher because I just talk about stealing money all the time? It's easy to, like, steal stuff. I mean, that's totally cool. I'm not going to rat him out or anything. I don't snitch. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Wow. What's that like, being homeschooled? Is that uh, is it pretty cool? Get to stay home all the time? Or is it stressful as hell? Having to hang around the parents and stuff. Darn it. The sorcerers have requisitioned, requisitioned the library again. Since they moved into the city, it's been barely accessible. I do wonder what they're searching for in there. Regardless, all this time I've been kept from reading the next installment of the Pirate Roberts adventure series. Oh, okay. Oh, these guys look like mages. They look scary. Sorcerer, dot dot dot. Sorcerers are too cool to talk. I don't think our beloved Emperor really wanted to go to war with the demons. After all, he had good relations with them. So why this war? Why now? I don't know, sir. Okay, let's check out the inn. Or have I already been here? No, I haven't been here yet. Okay. I go to a school that I talk to a teacher, so I'm always... Oh, okay, okay. Oh, that's pretty cool. 
Welcome to the River Rat Inn. I can honestly tell you that we're the best inn in town. And I'd even add, honestly still, that you'll remember your stay with us for a long time. Sometimes I want to check with these people to see if they, like, say something else. Because, you know, in some games, they will have multiple conversations. But in this one, it, it seems like they always just say one thing, and that's it. It's kind of sad. Get down here, Norbert. Don't try and tell me you're drunk. The alcohol in this beer evaporated years ago. I'm telling you, I saw them. Dot, dot, dot. There were these strange shapes swirling around me, trying to get inside me. Right as I was going by the sorcerer's headquarters. Well, I was right next to you, and I didn't see a thing. Maybe it was that mushroom dish you had. I did warn you not to eat anything here. Uh-oh. Okay. I talked to a different guy, and a trick eating. Uh, what's this dude up to? He's just chilling here. Every night I have the same dream. A young woman dressed in black and white in a gothic style maid outfit comes to speak to me. And then I wake up. I would give my most treasured possession for a moment with her in real life. Dot dot dot. Oh well, another drink, innkeeper. Yeah, it sounds like homeschool would definitely be a lot harder than just, like, regular school. But, uh, oh, okay, so it's actually, like, in a chat room. Oh, that's really neat, actually. I would probably prefer that than actually having to, having to go to school, but, but yeah, it sounds a lot more difficult. Welcome to the River Rat Inn. Enjoy our homebrewed beer, guaranteed frothless every time. Sample one of our home-cooked meals, fresh from yesterday or even last week. Sleep in our beds with fresh sheets changed less than a month ago. Have a most pleasant stay. After that pitch, I seriously deserve a raise. Yeah, that was that was a hard pitch. Whoa, are these soldiers? Last heard, my inn bridge was taken by the Empire. The demon forces have been routed, and their king is nowhere to be found. That should be a good enough reason to drink to the Emperor's health, but I think I'll avoid doing that here. I've been coming here every night for the past ten years, and the food is still as awful. Makes you wonder why I keep coming here. Yeah, why do I, anyway? Oh, whoa! She has an exclamation mark over her head. She has a quest. Let's explore around first. Is that a rat? That looks like a purple rat. Squeak. Squeak, squeak. Verified. That is a purple rat. What? A rat? Of course not. Our establishment is of the finest cleanliness. Must be a stuffed toy left here by a child. That's the most likely explanation, isn't it? Nope, that's a rat. Um, hmm. Let's get this quest and then... Uh, let's go see what's in here first. Oh, wow. Okay. Mr. Mudwell, are you looking to leave the city? I should be able to arrange that for you. Got some chicken feed for me? What? He wants chicken feed? You know, clams, moolah, something to smoothen our relationship. Not that I don't trust you, but a little collateral never hurts. Tycho, I don't like the looks of this guy. I don't think it's such a great idea to deal with him. The young lady is correct, at least in theory. However, I fear we have no other choice. In the army, we often say that the ends justify the means. I think the adage applies in the present circumstances, but I shall leave the strategizing to you, Mega Clink. So, you interested? I'm gonna say no for now. Now it's up to you. Nobody can say I'm twisting your arm, but if it was me... Well, anyway, there's no rush. So I guess if I want to get out of the city, I might have to talk to that guy, but... Let's save that for later, because I, I want to I wanna save my money. Hee 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 hee. You wish to bring something in or out of the city? Hee 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 hee. With reduced transit charges, of course. Hee 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 hee. Ask Mr. Mudwell. He's in the inner courtyard. Alright, cool dude. Catch you later, man. It was good talking to you. See you, man. Hee hee hee. Hee hee hee. Oh, oops.
Okay. So I guess that quest is just to talk to that guy in there. Let's save that for later, though. Same in? Same door? Yep, yeah, okay. Uh, what's this? Life is tough enough as it is. Then war has to come and ruin my business opportunities. Ugh, war. Anyway, I uh, will get at least a little damage around these parts. Always good for business. Damage. Mine in particular. <laughs> wow. Four gold. Living it up, baby. Getting rich. 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 Alright. Can I go this way? Nope, 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 nope. I can't drink from this. Attack this chicken. Welcome to the Genova Orphanage. We take care of all the children who've lost their parents to the war and other disasters. It's a constant commitment, every day and every hour. And unfortunately, every minute too. Well, that sounds horrible. That's a lot of kids. I'm resting for a second. Oh, I do hope they leave me alone. Is there any money to steal here? Come on, people. Eight. Wait, three gold or eight gold? I'm not sure. This is very pixelated. The red-haired girl is very kind. Yes, yes. Ask her. We have great fun together. I'm a sweet girl, right? Huh? Yes? What? I can't hear you. Dot, dot, dot. Say I'm sweet, say it! No. Dot, dot, dot. Wait a minute. I'll get you for this. <laughs> wow. I'm thinking I'm going to have to go pee soon. I'm hungry. When do we eat? I'm bored. Want to play a game? What happens if you say yes? Yes. <laughs> okay, then. Shop. Whee. Welcome to Raz's. What would you like to buy? Hmm. Uh, whiskey. Whiskey? That'll be 15 gold. Uh, I was just kidding. No thanks. All the weapons and pieces of armor have been requisitioned for the war. Come back and see us when it's over. Hmm. So I can't sell anything, apparently. Two gold, baby. Stealing from the store. Five gold. Three gold. I almost stole enough money to be able to afford some whiskey. Things are looking up. I keep watching from the jail. Apparently a prisoner got out. The lieutenants are all worked up about it. I wouldn't want to be a lieutenant. All that responsibility stuff. It's not my thing. Me neither, bud. I know where you're coming from with that. A prisoner escaped the jail. We sounded the alarm. Everyone's looking for him. We still don't know how he managed to dig such a long tunnel. Hmm. No one is allowed in or out of the jail for the time being. Lieutenant's order. What a pain. Stuck here while I'm supposed to be on a date with a waitress from the inn. If I catch that prisoner, I'm sure we're going to dig him a tunnel. I don't know what that means, but yikes. Just the barracks. Looks very barracky. Barracky. Is that a word? I don't know. I have to look for the lieutenant's glasses in this crate. Yes, I can see they're not there, but he quote unquote left them here. Orders are orders. So I'm searching. Whatever. 
Soldiering here is kind of a crash course in life skills. You can tolerate all the idiocy in the world after this. Or, of course, you just go mad. <laughs> I know. Sup, Holmes? Stupidity is like money. The more you have, the more you show it off. Don't go saying that to lieutenants, though. They might take it the wrong way. Then again, why would they think it was about them, huh? Just saying. The lieutenants make our lives miserable. They sometimes give orders that don't make any sense. Here, for example, I'm on the lookout for an approaching storm. That's right, indoors. No point in trying to make sense of them. Orders are orders. So, huh. I joined the force to follow Colonel Dalkin. He's my hero, a real soldier, and all the troops love him. It's a shame that in Genova, the army is led by idiot, by Mora, by the lieutenant, I mean. I wonder what he's trying to say. Hmm. Hmm. All right, talk to this guy. I wish I could exit out of conversations. Access to the outer walls is, for, is forbidden during wartime. Even the pigeons will have to learn to defecate elsewhere. Anyway, that's what the lieutenant is trying to teach them. We're all wishing him the best of luck. Soldiers aren't always very discriminating. But lieutenants are a whole other breed. We do this for the money. But they love their job. That's nuts, right? But hey, don't go around repeating it, alright? I could have level 99 problems. Okay, I can't go that way. I didn't find any money or anything in here. How disappointing. Ugh. I'm just here to rob G's, man. I just want that gill. Boy, do they call it gill or just G? I think they just say G. Long live the Empire. Long live Emperor Lothair. You know Professor Zero? He's the greatest inventor the Empire's ever known. Rumor has it, his top secret lab is somewhere in the mountains. Hmm, hmm. This door is closed. Okay, so... I think I've looked everywhere. Yeah, I already read this. I think I've already done everything. In this little area, besides, I guess, maybe sleep and... Like, I don't know what else. I can't leave. Okay, well, I guess I gotta talk to that guy in the end, then. See what he has to say. Look and leave the city. I should be able to arrange that for you. You know, clams, moolah. I know, you don't trust this guy. I know. Young lady is correct, at least in theory. Yep, 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 you know. We know. We know you don't like him. You already said this before. So, you interested? Alright, I'm interested this time. Let's see what happens. Ah, I think you and me are going to get along just fine. Small deposit to facilitate our relations. Let's say, oh, 620. Dude, I ain't got that much Skrilla. What the heck? Um, no. Oh. Well, darn. So now I gotta start this all over again and say yes, yes. Okay. Oh boy, here we go. Wee. Wee. Yes. Okay, but I ain't got it. Don't get your panties in a bunch. You've earned my trust now. So here's the deal. Bring me 150 G more and I'll get you out of here. Wait, did I actually have 620? Is that what happened? It asked for exactly how much I had? Okay. Oh, you can always refuse, of course. But in that case, I'll keep your deposit. Yes, I'll accept. I suppose you don't have or no longer have the money on you. Am I mistaken? If you want to leave, looks like you had to work for it. I know that ugly word. Personally, I try as often as possible to refrain from it. But at times, the ends justify the means. My assistant at the end should be able to help you find a few odd jobs. 
In return, you have to sleep there. I know, I know. It's no five-star accommodation. But just think of tomorrow, when you'll be free and far from the Empire. Good luck. Hmm. Am I sure that was a good idea? Yes. Make a clink. I shall never let you negotiate again. <laughs> okay, Cal. That's a bit harsh, Cal. I agree. Although, Tycho did fall for it. Hook, line, and sinker. But he's trying his best, and that's what really matters. Thank you, Rel. We have lost all our money, and what's more, we shall have to pay our way out of the city. First, first of all, that was our money, not yours. And secondly, you don't have to worry, because I'll see to it that we get out of this horrible place. Is that okay with you, Tycho? After all, Cal and you are on the lamb. Let me make myself useful and earn the money we need. Okay, sure. Thanks for trusting me. Okay, let's get to work. So now I'm playing as Rel. Hee <laughs> hee, you're here on behalf of Mr. Mudwell. What can I do for you, miss? I'm looking to do some work in order to pay Mr. Mudwell. Some work? Hmm, let's see. Here's a list of available positions. Let me know what jumps out at you. Waitress at Walk Donald's. Maid at the Delamere residence. Child care, none of the above. Okay, child care sounds horrible. Um... I'm pretty sure this maid at the Dalamare thing, that was pretty horrible too. Those people there were assholes. I don't want to be their maid. So let's waitress. Are you sure you want to accept waitress at Walk Donald's? Yes. Go to Walk Donald's. They'll tell you what you need to do. Just remember, don't eat anything there. I'm not sure I'm going to like this. Alright, let's do it. Let's go to job. Let's go to work. Welcome to Walk Donald's. We haven't started serving food yet. Stop by later. Oh, are you the new waitress? Perfect. You're right on time. We'll start serving food real soon. Can we explain what you have to do? Yes. You'll see. It's super easy. By watching closely, you'll see what mood the customer is in. Customers come in and sit down. You have to give them time to choose a meal without bothering them. Then, they'll want to place their order. After that, you just come see me to get the meal before bringing it to them. Don't get the order wrong. Next, the customers eat their meal. It'll take a different amount of time for each person. Just don't bother them while they're eating. Most of them really hate that. Once they're finished, they'll want to pay for their food quickly before leaving. Go to them fast so they don't leave without paying. Try to take a few orders at the same time before bringing out the meals. The customers like that better. That said, you can only serve one meal at a time. Well, that's it. Easy as pie. No. Alright, we are officially open. Go ahead and Oops, I didn't mean to click that. Okay. So, they sit down. They're happy. They're dot dot dot. They're dot dot dotting. Keep dot dot dotting. Question mark. I want, uh, let's see, today's special? Oh, wait. Not ready to order yet? I thought the dot 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 was. Oh, wait, that was an order. Can I have a salad? Okay. Oh, crap, I gotta remember what they want. Uh, today's special? Okay, I got today's special. Thanks, that was quick. And I need a salad. A salad. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, uh, wait, why did they go to a, a slashy face? I gave them a salad. They're eating. Come on, eat, eat, eat. Who wants to pay? Get out of here. I really enjoyed the meal, thanks. You're so welcome, sir. It wasn't bad, just so-so. 
Well, you ordered the salad, jackass. I didn't make you buy the salad. Come on. Don't come here and buy a salad and then complain about it. Jesus. Wait for that question mark. Wait, some dot dot dots, man. We're looking for question marks. Question marks. Salad. What do you want? Today's special and be quick about it. Uh, let's go to today's special. There you go. Wow, fast service. I need a salad. Uh, today's special. Salad. There you go. Thanks. That was quick. So today's special and uh, a big walk. Uh, today's special. Thanks, that was quick. And a big walk. There you go. Well, bam. Whee. Wasn't bad, just so so. Okay. Wasn't bad, just so so. Okay. Wow. I really enjoyed the meal. Thanks. You're welcome. Come on, hurry up. You're welcome. What do you want? I want the, uh, let's see, chef's pie. Alright, let's get a chef's pie. There you go. Thank you. Oh my god, there's so many people here right now. What do you want? Big walk. What do you want? Today's special and be quick about it. Today's special and a big walk. Oh my god. Today's special. Okay. Thanks, that was quick. And a big walk. What do you- Oh, no, 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 no. Let's just get a big walk. Uh, big walk. There you go, big walk. What do you want? Today's special. Okay. Oh my. Uh, today's special. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. There you go. Okay. Thank you. Okay, 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 okay. What do you want? Guy today's special. Sure. Source was pretty crummy. <laughs> You're welcome. Chef's pie. Today's special. Chef's pie. Big walk. Oh my god. Chef's pie. Today's special. Oh my god. This guy wants a chef's pie. I don't know. Oh my god. Okay, who wanted the chef's pie? I think it was this guy. Thanks. Okay. He wanted today's special. Okay. Oh, that person left. They're so pissed. I'm never going to here again. Okay. Uh, did you want... No. Oh my god. This is so bad. Okay. Oops. My bad. Thanks. You're welcome. Wow, that person is very, very upset. What do you want? Okay, you want a chef's pie. A uh, chef's pie, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Ugh, oh, that went, that went so badly. That went very, very, very poorly. I do not have the memory for this. Come on, come on. I'm just gonna stand behind you while you eat. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stand right here. I'm gonna stand right here while you eat. Sir is pretty crummy. Wow. Wow. Sir. Wow. I did my best. Nice. We're done for today. We waited on 15 customers today. However, we lost three. You need to improve if you want to continue working here. The average customer satisfaction was 4.9, which is average. Here are your wages. Feel free to come back and work for us. 80 bucks. Good goodness. That was, uh... Oh, is it already night? What a day. It's about time to head back to the inn. Okay, same thing. Alright. That was a tough day of work. Man. I'm wore out. I don't think I ever talked to this guy here. Mr. Mudwell spoke highly of you. No charge for the night. Will you be staying? Yes. <coughs> Sorry about that. 
All right. Here's a list of available positions. Let me know what jumps out at you. Oh, so I can't. I can't go back to uh, the Walk Donalds. Okay. I really don't want to be a maid at that one place where those ladies are totally horrible to people. Let's try childcare. Are you sure? Uh, yeah, I guess. Go to the orphanage. They'll tell you what you need to do. Just remember, try not to go crazy. Not what I had in mind as a kid. I always wanted to be an astronaut. Okay. Oh, let's try this. It's gonna be horrible. This is gonna be so horrible. I know it is. Welcome to the Genova Orphanage. We take care of all of the children who've lost their parents to the war and other disasters. It's a constant commitment, every day and every hour. And unfortunately, every minute too. Okay, so that's not the person I talked to. Who do I talk to? I'm resting for a second. Oh, I do hope they leave me alone. Oh, you're the new girl. You're a lifesaver. Well, I suppose you know what to do. I'll leave you to take care of them then. Um, excuse me. I do not know what to do. Wow. She is out of there. I'm free! Dun, dun, dun. Hi, kitties. You wanna play? Let's play hide and seek. Sweet! Yeah, too cool! You're awesome, man! Oh, yeah, cool! Oh, boy. Oh, now I gotta go find them. Okay, well. This is hide and seek on me, I guess. Are you? Are you one of the kids? No. Is the kid in the water? The kid is not in the water. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Are they? In? Hey, there's one of the kids. Do they go inside the buildings? Found you, kid. Oh no, how'd you find me? Because I'm smart and I'm an adult. Is the rat one of the kids? I bet it is. Do, 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 do. Are you a kid? Nope, yeah. You hiding any kids in here? Hey, you one of the kids? No. He's not. Okay. I already read your thing. I know. I know. Just stop talking. Good lord. Oh. She doesn't have a sword. She just punches. You want the kids in here? You're not one of the kids. I guess I should check the building just to make sure. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so they do go inside the buildings. I know you're a cheater. Whatever, kid, get out of here. I caught you. What are you doing? Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, there's one of them. You're really good at this, ma'am. Yes, I'm one of the best. Actually, I should check this building down here. Are you a kid? <laughs> hey Trixie, how's it going man? I am on a gaming spree. I think I've played more games like in the last two or three weeks than I have in the whole entire year or ever in my life. How are you doing man? I'm just uh don't take this wrong, but I'm just looking for kids right now. I've got two kids to find. No. Hmm. Where are these kids? Oh, yeah. 
Did you finish that? Have, have you watched all of uh, Life is Strange now? That game is so awesome. Alright, one kid to go. Where's this last kid at? I wouldn't know anything about any pesky kids. I feel like I've looked everywhere now. Yeah, that that the ending of that last one was crazy. I can't wait to see what they do with the uh, with the final episode. The story is very similar. There um, there are a few things in uh, in Life is Strange that you can change. You know, so uh, like for example, the suicide or whatever. That you can actually change, and I have no idea what happens when you change it, so I, I don't really know what's different. But uh, I kind of need to play through it, I guess, and figure out how to how to beat that. Oh wait, here's one of them. here's one of the kids, I think. Yay! I had the best hiding place ever. No, you didn't, because I found you. I know, uh, Ultima Greg, he has, um, Until Dawn, I think. He's talked about streaming it. I'm kind of hoping he does at some point. So I want to watch it. I want to watch somebody I know play it. Yeah, I don't think it would have any major effects either, but, uh, maybe there's something that changes. I don't know. I'll get you for that. Next time you won't find me. Come back and see us every day. Wow, these kids really like me. You're so cute. Thank you, ma'am. Where's my money? Are you okay? How did it go? They were well behaved, I hope. Here we go again. But I have to say, I missed them. This is for you. Give me some money. 80 bucks. Nice. Score. Yeah, I think that's the way a lot of games are. The illusion of choice. That's so true. Oh, it's already night. What a day. It's about time I head back to the inn. Oh, wait. I need to go talk to this guy. No, wait. I wonder if I can talk to this dude now, since I have the 150 bucks. Oh, he's asleep. You know, it, until dawn does seem to to impact it a little bit, but it seems like 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 there are a couple of people that definitely won't die. You know, so the story is always the same at like a certain point, I guess. You know, I guess certain people aren't there, and there are are dialogue that doesn't happen, but it seems like it's not a huge difference. I've watched I think like maybe three playthroughs of it. I mean, I would love to play it myself, but it just doesn't seem like. Uh, I mean, it seems like at some point it would get tiring. There's actually a guy on Twitch who does speedruns of Until Dawn. It's crazy. It is fun to see some of the different dialogues, like, uh, like, like choosing, um, I can't remember their names, but the, the two guys who are dating the same girl, having them fight, for example. That stuff's pretty funny. So, did you have the 150G? Yes. Ah. Congratulations. I worked hard. Take this key. You can use it to leave through the sewers. No need to thank me. Your financial contribution is plenty thanks enough. I wasn't going to thank you anyway, dude. Key to the sewers. We made it. We're finally getting out of this city. Thank you, Miss Rail. Thanks to you, I shall see my son again. And perhaps there is still time. To save my people. Oh yeah, only one playthrough. Yeah, I mean, I I've seen like at least three, I guess. You know, I, I watched the speedrun guy a couple of times. You know, but he always did the same thing. But you know, I've watched other people do it. But it's still really, really good. The butt physics and until dawn. You know, it does have pretty good butt physics. I think there's better out there, but but they did well. They uh, they really studied. Don't mention it, Cal. It's natural to help one another. 
when you share the same fate. Rill is so, so awesome in this game. Like, he's so deep. The same fate. We demons do not believe in fate, only in free will. Sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. It was just a figure of speech. No harm done. Cal really got carried away there. Uh, Taiko, I think it's time you take the lead in our little expedition. Let's go. Wait. Take this, a little keepsake from me. With thanks from the house. I got a loyalty badge. The kind of item that is completely useless. I like useless items. Yeah, I'm kind of interested to see also. Um, I've seen, I think, like a little bit further when it gets a little bit 3D, but you know, I haven't, I haven't really spoiled myself with this game too much. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty interested in it. Oh yeah, little 2D scroller action here. Uh, gravity. I like that. I have gravity in my hands. <laughs> this item cannot open this door. I can't really look at this to see exactly what it is, but oh well. Oh no, look at us. Yeah, look at that. I was almost hoping a mushroom would pop out instead. Yeah, I agree. I think like the indie, the whole... Uh, Ability for people to, to make games in like an indie fashion helps with this, you know, it makes uh, It's a lot easier to make games like this in other words as opposed to a huge Triple-a thing. This is my treasure. Do not touch mr. Mudwell. Oh my god. What I just got all my money back Ha jokes on that guy What is this? Okay No, I want to see if I can jump on top of that to see if there's maybe like a hidden block. You know, Super Mario always has some some sort of hidden block. Yeah, yeah, Kickstarter's so awesome when when they actually make the game. Yay! Free at last. So Taiko, what do we do now? Go home, follow Cal. How about a snack? Look for a Magalith, kill mobs, and gain experience. I'm not so sure it's the right time for a snack. Don't you think we have better things to do? So, what do you say, Tycho? Um, go home? Not a bad idea, but I don't really see how. So, what do you say, Tycho? Okay, fine. Let's kill mobs and get experience. No way! We can farm mobs later, after we progress more in the story. Wow. So, what do you say? Fine, let's look for Magalith. Of course. That's it. An excellent idea. I don't know exactly how we ended up here, but it's somehow connected to the Megalith. If we find one, maybe then we can go home. We need to hurry. My father is going to worry. Well, come to think of it, if the Megalith does allow us to time travel, he's not even born yet. So if we go back to before we left... Ah! Thinking in four dimensions hurt my brain. I do not quite grasp your conundrum. But if it is a Magalith you seek, you will find one north of my father's encampment. Oh boy, we're gonna go visit the demons. That's our ticket home. We'll go with you, Cal. I mean, if you don't mind. The pleasure is mine, Miss Rell. Miss Rell. However, I do not know whether we shall reach my father's camp unlearned. If the rumors are to be believed, Main Bridge was taken by the Empire, but perhaps we can cross it. Let us head north. We shall decide once we get there. Your strength will be of great use, Mega Clink. Yes, yes, it shall. Off we go. Ooh, yeah! Look at this! Wow! Oh, man. Main bridge, okay. 
clearing. I think that's where I came from, the clearing. Oh, look at this. I can travel all the way over here. Hefas Smithy. A smithy? What if they have weapons here? Oh my. Okay. All right, Trixie, have a good one, man. You're still jet lagged, man. All right, have a good night, dude. Catch you later. I'll I'll probably post this playthrough up on uh, YouTube later if you want to catch it then or something. I don't know if we're gonna start some Minecraft. That would be awesome if they do some uh, like Minecraft stuff in this. Yep, see you, man. Oh, what was that? Oh. I'm just looking for your money, dude. Just, just trying to steal all your gold, your gill. You waste your time bothering me as I have no weapons for sale. You see, I only fashion the most exceptional of weapons. But such arms can only be forged with auric and ore. You dug up some auric? Oh, let me forge you an item with that. What would you like me to make? Hmm. Okay. I mean, like, I would like a sword. You know? Let's go with a sword. You want me to forge an orc and sword? To make that item, I'll need to use four pieces of orc and ore, alright? Huh. Why'd you collect all that ore if you're not gonna use it? Uh, what's the armor cost? Five orc and ore. No. What about the cheapest one, which is probably on top? What about the belt? Two pieces, okay. No. Alright, let's save up some Orchid Ore and, and get this guy to make us some stuff later. So I wonder what's through here. Working or I got two pieces now. Huh. I wonder if I should get the belt. I think I might make the belt. This is probably a strategic mistake. You probably only get like five pieces ever. And the best thing to do is hold out for the armor, but I want to do it anyway. Let's get a belt. Wait. Boots are probably three. Yeah, let's get a belt. Yes. Here we go. Boom. 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 Knock it out, homeboy. Yeah. Get it. And it's complete. A very stunning ultimate belt. Gorgeously decorated. Mighty fine work if I do say so myself. Please, come back and see me if you have other items that need forging. Okay, so I guess I'm already wearing it. There doesn't seem to be a way that I can tell to, like, modify your equipment. Here's hoping it doesn't shatter. Very stunning, okay. Okay, well, that was interesting. So that's the Mayan Bridge. What is this thing? Sierra. What's up, Holmes? Would you happen to know anything about the dreaded pirate Roberts? The Empire is currently tied up with the war against the demons. But sooner or later, we'll catch him, and he'll pay for his misdeeds. 
If only we knew what he looked like. Man, I ain't gonna rat nobody out to the cops. Don't even try to get me to snitch. I ain't snitching, man. I don't snitch. Oh, treasure chest. Yeah. What is it? Collectible star, 5 of 30. Oh, yeah. Big pimpin'. Collecting the treasure chest, you know. You know how I do. Some pirates have set up on the nearby island. Must be nice being a pirate. Sail the seas, going wherever the wind takes you. Oh, would that I were a few years younger. Oh, if so. If only. Wow, this person is a large. I dream that one day my Prince Charming will take me away on a beautiful white steed. Yeah! Um, could you be him? By the look on her face, I don't think Tycho is the one. What does she have on her head? Is that hair or is that like poo? Looks kind of like poo. I'm just saying. It looks like it looks very pooey. Yeah, get it. Okay, I can't really do anything here, so I'm out. What's down here? Ooh, Windy Valley. Oh my. Oh, this looks like something too. What is this? Grizzly Pass? Wait. Okay, I remember taking Grizzly Pass before. Oh, it was a Grizzly Pass that we got caught. And taken to the, uh, the castle, that's right. Laboratory. <laughs> okay. I don't really want to go explore that stuff right now. Wait, actually, what is my quest? I don't even remember what my quest is. Am I supposed to go to the laboratory, or am I supposed to go to the bridge? Let's go to the laboratory, see what's up here. I mean, if nothing else, I'm getting dollar bills. Dollar dollar bills. Oh, okay. So I can't go here. Because it has some weird door with a key. And, yeah, I can't go this way, obviously. Okay. I think I'm supposed to go to the bridge. Actually, let's go here real quick. Nothing else? Just to give me some dollar bills. Oh, I like the music here. This is very mellow. And there's nothing to do here. Okay. Well, just got a couple of bill dollar bills and uh, heading back to the bridge. That was fun. We Daggerland Plains, Demonia, Genova City. Okay. talk to this homeboy here. The Empire has deployed troops in enemy territory, so civilians aren't allowed past this point. Huh? I don't feel very safe here. Between the demons in the north and that big boulder on my left that's in danger of falling. Sorry, no one is allowed across the bridge at this time. In the name of the Emperor, I command you to stop. I've always wanted to say that. Careful! The boater is going to fall this way! I'm standing like right underneath it. Quickly, Tycho! Let's make haste and cross the bridge! 
Aha! Gotcha! <laughs> yeah! Look at that! That's some puzzle solving right there. Wow! I'm solving puzzles here. Ow! I hate it when I walk like one pixel too far and they hit me. Oh wow, this place is destroyed! Haunted forest? <laughs> what? I don't want to go to a haunted forest? No, no haunted stuff, please. This place gives me goosebumps. I wanna wanna spend my vacation here. We call it the haunted forest. Uh haunted? I hate ghosts! Are you not aware that ghosts do not exist, Miss Rail? Oh god, what? Did you hear that? <laughs> Taco protect me. Mega Clink protect us. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. He 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 he, you are not welcome here, Master Jetai told us not to let you through. Turn back or die. Oh my. Dot dot dot. Let's turn back, shall we? There must be another way to reach my father's encampment. At least I hope so. No way! First off, those ghosts didn't look so tough, and second, Tycho and I are really in a hurry to get back home. So, are you with me, Tycho? Should we move forward? Yes. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. Well, hmm. After you, in that case. Hee 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 I think we just found his weakness, Tycho. Oh man, this sound, this music. Goodness gracious. Oh god. Oh god, what? Get him, Rail. Oh my. What was that sound? Oh gosh, what? Ow, you son of a bitch, he changed up his attacks. I don't think they're allowed to do that, frankly. What is this is all foggy. I really like this music, man. This is awesome. Ugh. Oh, okay. Let's head over this way first, though. Scare me. There's some big scary guy over there. That guy scares me. Alright, let's head this way and save. Making that money. Click, click, click. Hee hee hee! No way are you walking out of here! Oh gosh! Why does he get to hit me, but I can't hit him? Grr! That was weird. Okay. I think I figured it out, though. Like. You gotta kill the things around it, and then you kill it, I guess. I don't know. <clears throat> I 
Ah! Leveled up! Level 10, plus 1 damage. I get no defense and no hit points. Okay, well, this game hates me, apparently. Look at that creepy, creepy tree, man. Yeah! the boss. I'm the boss. Where am I going? Okay. Ooh. Oh gosh. Green goop. I find a lot of green goop. I think I can go any way up here. Maybe I go to the right? Nope. Huh, okay. Well, I don't really know how to get to the left or to the right over there. Wait, maybe if I come down here. Oh my gosh, where am I? Something like that? No? <laughs> okay. I feel like there's maybe more to explore in there, but I'm not sure. Edge of the forest. Well, let's go down here. Let's explore some more. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, okay. Ah. <laughs> this is a pain in the ass. Holy shit. Okay, now I can hit him, right? Yeah, okay. Now your ass is mine! Ha! Ah. You ain't nobody. You ain't nobody. Guy thought he was tough. He thought he was something.
It's not triggered that yet. Huh. So I mashed that down, but I can't get to it. That sucks. Oh my, what is this? Hello, sir. Hello, good sir. How are you? So you're the intruders who dared enter my forest. This is Jatai. This forest belongs to the King of Demonia. Though it lies near the Empire, it is clearly on our territory. Humans, demons, you're all the same, aren't you? Killing each other over a line drawn on a map. Well, this forest is mine, because me and my ghost friends live here. Those ghosts are your friends? Yes, absolutely. They entertain me whenever I like. Uh, sounds more like servants than actual friends. Dut, dut, dut. Actually, actual friends. And what would you know about it, humans? Dut, dut, dut. If you think you're so special, humans, find my ghosts. You'll not get through this forest without catching them. <laughs> you still have three more to find. Poor guardian. He doesn't know what it's like to have a friend. I must say, I do not like the looks of this place. No lie. I tried going left. Can't really... Also tried going right just for the heck of it, and I didn't really find anything else there. Uh, let's see. So I'm looking for three more ghosts. So clearly this is going to be one. I guess I need two more ghosts. <laughs> what? Okay. Maybe I missed some ghosts over this way? I don't know. Okay, that's two ghosts. So one left.
Was there maybe one, like, at the beginning of this place that I didn't, before I realized ghosts popped out of them? I feel like this is the beginning, so... Okay, how do I get inside there? Looks like I need to... Oh, there's one over there in the middle. Yeah, how do I get over there? Oh, okay. Well, that is clearly not the answer. So how do I get over there? Level up! Level 11! I gained 1 defense and 4 health. Nice. Oh, I gotta kill all this stuff again. How annoying. But, free money, I guess. So, yay! Free shiny things. Now. You big old bullies, quit it. Leave me alone, you bullies. Nine hundred and twenty four bucks doing good, if I do say so myself. Pretty soon if I ever find somebody that sells armor, I wanna be set for life. Okay, the last one's gotta be down here someplace. These zombies are tough. Good lord. Zombie apocalypse, they better not be this tough. Probably because I'm not aiming for the head. Maybe that's a special skill. Oh gosh, these guys are back. so easy yet it's like it's slightly difficult ah, it confused me so I got this one yes oh okay there we go nice okay and then that leads downstairs where am I Oh, okay, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and get this guy first. No? Okay, maybe I have to hit it from down here. I gotta hit it from down here. Oh, do I need to do some jumping? Oh! Ooh! Jump up here. I 
I feel like it's possible to make this. <laughs> if this is like a pixel perfect jump. Oh well. the world. Is the game trying to straight up kill me? I did a bad. I think I did a bad. Did I do a bad? Sticky. Maybe it's because I watched South Park yesterday, but his jumps sound a lot like Cartman. the ghosts. I am the man. I killed all that guy's friends. I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. Over this way. I killed all your friends. If you think you're so special, humans, find my ghosts. You'll not get through this forest without catching them. Ha 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 ha. What? You found all my ghosts? Then, as promised, I'll let you leave the forest. But who will I play with now? Go away and never come back again. He'll be all alone here. I couldn't take that. Let us journey on, Mega Clink. My father's camp is not much farther. Haha, uh -huh. I killed all your friends. An actual friend? Leave now and never return. Let's fight. I want to fight you. Oh yeah, I remember our trying already to go that way. Okay, so now I get to leave. Level up! What do I get? Four damage, no defense, and one health. Nice, level 12.
Now I can leave the forest. Alright, where are we going to now? Demon Camp. Whoa, look! Poolmans! How do they find our camp? Quick, grab them, we can't let them escape. Wait. Lord Cal. You're alive. The king thought you lost forever after the sorcerers captured you. Nay. These humans helped me to escape Genova. They are my guests. No harm must come to them. Humans helped you? Believe it or not, they did. Take me to my father. I must speak with him at once. And inform my son that I have returned. <gasps> Cal has a son. Oh, that's right. He said before that. Something about that. Yes, Lord Cal. Lord Cal? I will explain everything later. I want to see my father before it is too late. Thank you again for your help. Dot, dot, dot. Well, alright then. How some humans like you for Lord Cal, that I do not know. But I've got my eye on you. You're lucky, humans. Look, they chop wood just like humans. Wow. 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 Hey. Humans in the Demon King's cap? Now I've seen it all. Don't touch anything. These people do not trust me at all. I'm gonna steal all their shit. You should probably follow Lord Cow and see what's happening, but since you seem so interested in the lives of demon soldiers here, I will tell you about my own. I was born 60 years ago, which makes me fairly young for a demon. We live much longer than humans. You know, my childhood in Demonia was rather peaceful. There were indeed a few wars with your previous emperor, but nothing too serious. Fairly routine, you know? Humans and demons have never really gotten along. Which reminds me that I once had a human friend. Oh, he wasn't like you at all, but we had some good times together. And that's probably why I'm telling you all this. In fact, what I, what was I going to say? That, that, that? I don't really remember, but no matter. Thank you for coming and speaking to me. It's nice to chat with someone. The other demons don't like to talk to me on account I talk too much. As if liking to talk was a flaw. Well, it's true I like to have a chat with people who come and see me. But then they quickly walk away. Do you have any idea why? No, of course you don't. It I also seems it also seems I forgot that I've met people, and so I do the same thing over and over. Can you believe that? I for one believe it, because I don't know if you've noticed, but everyone does the same thing. It's really odd, isn't it? I do wonder if there's not an unsolved mystery in there somewhere, a hidden meaning to the universe. That we're all just robots made to spit out what someone else wrote. Yeah, I know, I'm talking nonsense, but why not, right? After all, the greatest strides made by science were based on the most outrageous theories. Dot 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 dot. Well, that's me done, I think. Money, money, money. Aren't you hungry? I am. And you look pretty appetizing. What? Do demons eat humans? Ha <laughs> like I was gonna eat you. Then again, that's the kind of stories you tell your young ones, right? I don't really tell my young ones any stories of demons. Your human friends attacked us by surprise, despite the truce we observed for nearly ten years. How could they be so cowardly? Any friend of Lord Cal is a friend of mine. What do you need? Ooh, let's sell. Okay, I can't really sell anything, I guess. 
Ah, so I can buy a bronze sword and bronze armor. Yeah, let's let's hook it up. Buy a bronze sword for 200 G. Yes. It looks nice, but dang, is it heavy? Let's buy some bronze armor. Yeah, hell yeah. Whenever you take it off, you'll be able to jump 10 feet higher in the air. Okay, so now I can sell the old sword. Yes. And that's it. Okay, quit. Come back anytime. So one thing I noticed is the belt does not say E next to it, like equipped. But I don't really have an option. I don't really have the ability to equip anything. So... I mean, it's there on the little equipped screen. Okay, well, I don't really know what that's about. I mean, I hope it's equipped. I hope it's doing something. I don't know. Hope it at least looks good. It looks hot. I will never trust humans again. Not after that attack in the middle of a truce. I'm sorry. Whoa, what is that? Up on the top right, maybe like a mushroom? At first I thought it was like some sort of body part or something. Unless you're spies. If Lord Cal trusts you, then so do I. Father, I have returned. So his father's name is Arthas Cal, my son. I thought I had lost you. When the Empire soldiers joined forces with the sorcerers and attacked us out of nowhere, despite our ten-year truce, you were the one who stepped in and allowed us to escape. I only did my duty as a general of our people's army. I had to protect you. You did your duty. I'll grant you that. The current situation is dire. Following the surprise attack by the Empire's forces, we were separated from the rest of the army. I've been trying to rally our troops from here, but we're too far behind. The sorcerer's power is too great. Father, we must fight. I know, but things are off to a bad start. I fear Demonia will be attacked before we can reach and defend it. After centuries of coexistence, it seems as the humans have now decided to exterminate us. We cannot let that happen. And not all humans are evil. I learned that during my stay in Genova. I'm glad that you made friends in these dark times. Father, there's something else. The Empire, they have built something they call the Weapon. I've yet to identify its energy source, but it has frightening power. If they ever use it against us, our entire kingdom would be wiped off the map. I've heard stories about this weapon with a capital W. But I did not think, if what you say is true, we must stop them from using it. I will not leave my people to die. Father. Dad! <laughs> Who's Reno? Dad, you came back. I knew you were alive. Ah, oh, Reno's kid. Huh? Reno, my son. Forgive me. My absence must have caused you much grief. Not one bit. I didn't even cry. I knew my dad was the strongest of all. Ha ha ha. Yes, your father is very strong indeed. He killed all those mean humans and came home. Yeah. Are those humans your prisoners, Dad? No. Those are nice humans. I would even call them my friends. Aw, where's friend? Nice humans? But there are no nice humans. Ha 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 You shall see when you grow up. I hope you two will have human friends. Never! Wow, Reno hates us. Wow. Miss Rao, Megaclink, forgive him. 
He is but a child, and to him all humans are the enemy. I understand. But if human children and demon children all believe the myths, can there ever be t peace between our two peoples? Dot, dot, dot. This is getting into some deep stuff. I almost forgot. You did not come here to listen to these stories. I will take you to the megalith that's north of the encampment on the bluff. He didn't answer my question. Dot, dot, dot. All right. So that was a very long conversation, but what did we learn from it? I guess uh, demon kids hate us, human kids hate demons. Um, there's never going to be peace in the realm because of this. Bad stuff always happens. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, that was fun. Let's roll. Oh yeah, those purple bushes, they give the money. They're like the haunted bushes, haunted with money. Ooh. Wow, look at the background, it's so pretty. Here's the megalith I spoke of. That's definitely a megalith. It has the same symbols etched into it as the one that brought us here. But then, I don't know how to activate it. Activate it? Megaliths are nothing more than monuments of the ancient Magi civilization. Magi, I guess. They do not serve any purpose. What was that? Dad! It's the Empire! The sorcerers are attacking the camp! What? How in the world did they find us? Find them. This is G Magus. No member of the Demonian royal family must get away. Oh boy. Oh boy. Ah, there you are. The Grey Magus. Run away, son, run! <laughs> he got the hell out of there. Caledemonia, son of King Arthas, general and heir to the throne. I have you to thank for this. Really? No! How did you... How did I follow you? Oh, it wasn't that hard. Although I didn't think you would make it through the haunted forest. But when you did survive, all it took to track you down was guessing where you would exit from. And here I am. What have I done? This is all my fault. Oh, don't fret now. You won't have to despair much longer. Watch out! Oh my. They disappeared. How could that be? Find them. They can't be very far. Wow, that was like magic. Ooh. Whoa, hello. Look at that sword. Damn. Dot, dot, dot. Hello! Well, what the heck were you doing here? Wait. Well, what the heck were you doing here? You are taking advantage of my being. No. Nah. Where are we anyway? Magellan. It activated when the sorcerer destroyed it. It means we're back home. 
Well, I hope. I have the strange feeling of, of volume. Just like that day I ate too much chocolate, but without the stomach ache. Don't you have the same feeling, Taika? No. I promise I've been too busy lately to eat any. Anyway, enough about this chocolate mousse thing. That Magilith will no longer work. Dut, dut, dut. Where have the sorcerers gone? And my son, how is he? Cow. Actually, it's a bit complicated. Where should I begin? What do you mean, complicated? They are all dead, is that it? Well, hold on. Let me explain. This isn't gonna be easy. We're not in the same time as before. Taiko and me come from the present. Well, your present, not his present. I mean, for you it's the future. But to us, your present is our past. I'm not sure I'm being very clear. I did not understand a thing. They are all dead, is that what you are trying to tell me? In a way, yes. Or maybe they're just older. Dot dot dot. I refuse to continue this conversation. I must find my son and save my father. Oh, he's out of there. Bye, cow. It was nice knowing you. I think I'm going to need a new approach. We can't leave him alone, Tycho. Wow. Look how little the world is. <laughs> I really like this game. Oh my, what is this? Cow. In the year 950 of our Lord, here were the demons vanquished by Emperor Lothair and his troops. The inscription on the statue. How is this possible? That's what I was trying to explain, Cal. The Magilith. We traveled through time. Taiko and I come from year 999, almost 50 years after the demons were defeated. An accident led us to your time, and the Empire catched it. Catched us? Caught us? And when the Great Magus destroyed the Mag Mag Magilith, something came out of it. I think that thing brought us here. I really wish we'd returned home, but I get the feeling we're in a different time period. All of this seems impossible. And yet, the statue. But why? What is the meaning of our lives if everything is already written? I don't understand it much myself. But look at Taiko. He continues to fight no matter what. At first, I was terrified at the thought of being lost. But while following Taiko, I began to understand. Life is just right now. This very moment. Wherever you happen to be. I don't know if the past has already happened or if the future can be changed. But I know I exist right here, right now. It's just me in the here and now. And Tycho is the one who made me realize that. So I'm not afraid anymore. Although rats and mushrooms still do it, of course. I am not convinced. My people have been conquered. And I shouldn't be here. My son, what has become of him? He's probably dead. Instead of asking ourselves all these questions, we'd be better off looking for another magic. If we were able to go back into the past, then you should be able to return to your own time. Let's focus on that instead of dwelling on questions we can't answer. Hey, don't I sound like an adult, Tycho? <laughs> oh, Rail, you're so crazy. I don't know if I can be as strong as Mega Clink or Miss Rail, but I'll do my best.
Alright, so I like this new 3D world. To the future! Oh wow! It's like everything's grown up. BB's tent. Whoa. This is mysterious. Very mysterious indeed. Is this a witch? Oh, look at that eye. Whoa. Oh, that's creepy. Ah, what a fine young man you are. Folks call me Granny BB, but I've got the heart of a young woman. Besides, I'm not really that old. So anyways, feel free to invite me out some evening. <laughs> we could go out for potions. Maybe more if you feel a spark. Hey, speaking of potions, what can I do for you, darling? Um... Hope you brought me the good stuff, my sweet gummy bear. <laughs> oh my god, what? Uh, what does she want? Uh, green goop? Granny BB's gonna fix you a real nice potion. You got a green potion, restores half of your hit points. Nice. Think of me when your pretty lips touch the bottle. <laughs> what? Okay, hang on one second. Uh, hang on just a minute here. <laughs> I guess I met somebody. Okay. Sorry about that. He 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 he. What can I do for you, darling? Can I buy another potion? Uh, I do have more green goops. What about red goops? Granny BB's gonna fix you a real nice potion. Restores all your hit points. Hell yeah. Think of me when your pretty lips touch the bottle. <laughs> what can I do for you? Alright, let's go ahead and convert these green ones. You know you can only carry a single potion of the same type. My fallen angel. Um, what else can we use here? Can I give her gravity? What do you want me to do with that, my BFG 9000? What can I do for you, darling? Nothing. See you soon, my rubber ducky. Wow. <laughs> this lady is, uh... I like her. Haunted Forest. Wow. Ah, a new recruit. Don't you worry, this job is real easy. We just find stuff that's banned in the capital and resell it to people who want it. It's not too dangerous, as long as you don't get caught by the militia, of course. If you bump into the boss, don't judge him by his appearance. Some people call him a monster, but that's because they don't know him. And anyway, he takes good care of us. Without him, we'd just be run-of-the-mill thieves. I don't really think I... I, I don't think I should be here, so let's go explore the uh, other world a little bit more. This bridge is not as big as I remembered it. Hey, whoa, hey. Wow, these squirrels.
Oh, okay. That's the actual bridge down there. That makes more sense. Hello. Hi there. It's not often you see somebody on this side of the bridge. We used to call this Man Bridge, but a hundred years ago, a boulder fell and blocked it. No one's ever been able to remove it. Then again, since the war ended, people don't really come out to Demonia anymore. Anyway, I doubt any human will ever break that boulder. For sure, our boss is tough enough to smash through that boulder. I tell you, though, he's stubborn as a friggin' goat. He barely ever leaves that haunted forest. You'd have to force him to move his hiney over here, but nobody dare. I mean, he just scares everybody off. But deep down, he's a really nice guy. What if I do this? I do not think I have the strength to break this boulder for now. Okay, well, I guess I have to go back to the haunted forest. Maybe I can tell that one guy, I'll be your friend if you if you break that boulder. We'll be BFFs forever. And BFFs. I used to live in Genova. My dream was to become a trader, but I quickly learned that only traders' sons become traders. So then I came here. When you think about it, our workers kind of like what traders do. Don't say anything bad about the boss. He's our savior. Many of us are sons of pirates. Long ago, a volcano erupted on our island. The boss took us in and taught us a new trade. The boss grew up here, so he's very attached to the forest. Personally, I found it a bit gloomy at first, but I got used to it eventually. What? Ghosts? Uh, you do know ghosts don't exist, right? If you're looking for the boss, I'm afraid he's had a bad day. He took off to get some rest in his lair. Best not to disturb him while he's in that mood. He's a short fuse. And besides, his lair is chock full of booby traps. Anyway, it's up to you. You've been warned. Thank you for the warning, sir. Looks like we got ourselves a little dungeon here. Oh my. Oh my, okay. Why well, aren't you just a fucking asshole? So if I step over here, will he... Yeah, okay. Gosh damn, man! Oh my god! <laughs> I didn't anticipate that. Oh man. These spiders are on crack. I'm almost dead here. Oh god. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I gotta hit him in the back. Oh boy. Oh boy. We'll do that.
Yeah, he's so tough. Oh my, what is this? Now it's on fire. Now it's pissed off. Hitting anything here. Oh. Ow. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Alrighty, solving puzzles. I really wish I could hit that safe spot right there before this guy kills me. Oh wow, this guy split into a lot. Ah, oh, save. Okay, now I'm happy. Rusted. Sweet. I can blow. I can blow off steam on something that won't complain. Afterwards. Apologies in advance if I break it. Good job, bro. Appreciate the effort. Aw, oh, poor little fishies. Dropping the big dollars. Five cents, man. Dropping nickels. Okay, I got two defense, five hit points. I'm up to 68 hit points. What's that? All I'm supposed to do? I guess. Okay. Let's see. Whee! Oh my. Oh. Oh. 
I want that money. Why can't I get that money? Um, okay, so wait. There's already one over here. Uh, wait a minute. So there's one already over here. Shit, over here. Right? Yeah. So I need to get... Across there somehow. Ow. Okay, so it needs to go there. Haha, <laughs> you're dumb. Okay, boom! Puzzle solving! What's up with that guy? Oh my. Puzzle solving. Oh, my. Ooh. Freaking King Slime here. Now, stop jumping on me. Oh boy, okay. <laughs> I didn't do anything, damn it. Pretty interesting. Little old king slime fight. We'll almost back up to a thousand G. Getting them G's.
Look at that treasure chest. What we got? You got a strange gem. Yet another item that's likely to bring you trouble. All right. Huh. You didn't think I seen you, but I did. Alright, so now this way... Treasure chest. Red goop. Okay. Huh. Huh. All right. What? <laughs> Suckers. <laughs> that slime really wants it, man. Look at him. Ah. Spiders are so damn quick. I hate some. I hate the spiders. What do you want? Oh my god, what? Yeah, let me go. Rawr. 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 Huh. 
Oh, okay. Spiders. Yeah. Unlocking ra rafts. We. This guy walks weird. supposed to do? Oh, wait. Wouldn't it be easier to hit them from up here, maybe? Ah, yeah. oh, he can collect them. Nice. Give me the hearts. I want the hearts and the money. Just give me the money. broken. Okay, so I guess I need to go up here again. Ugh. Why would I even need to, though, actually? Like, I mean, I don't think I have to do this, do I? I just want the money. I want them, I want them G's, man. Yeah, let's get that. Oh, yeah. It's delicious. So what's the point of this? To destroy these down here, maybe? Let's explore. Oh my, okay. Well, I guess that was the I guess that was the point. A raft! Yay! Sweet. Okay, so here's a question. How do I get this? Can I walk him through here? No? Pretty sure I cannot. Hmm. Can I attack this thing? No? Yeah, those throw me back. Oh well. So now where am I supposed to go here? Okay, I already went that way. Oh, this wasn't open before, I don't think. Okay, there's a chest down there. Something over there I need to go stand on. I need to go stand on that. Um...
It's ticking. Okay, so it doesn't last very long. Okay, let's try this. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to hit both of these. I did have enough time. Nice. Another strange gym. Okay, smell. Get out of here. How to get that chest over there, though? Well, let's see. Strange gym. You've used one gym, but the other is still missing. No, it's not. Strange gym. All right. Whoa! That was freaky. Hello, friend. I'm your new friend. Whoa, hello. He's upset. Who broke my beautiful pots? Oops. My bad. I love those pots. Oh. I recognize you. You're the ones who came and chased my ghost friends out of the forest. And now that I've got new friends, you want to take those away from me too? No. I don't believe you. I see I have no choice. I'll have to get rid of you. Oh my. Okay. Well, let's fight, baby. Let's oh gosh. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Ah. Okay. So these things here do damage to him, okay. Oh my, okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, okay. Set down. Uh, that didn't have the same effect as last time, unfortunately. Is he throwing more of these shells out? Oh, he is so pissed. Oh my. He is really pissed. He is not a fan of me at the moment. Oh, different side. Oh. Oh my god, what? Okay. Take that, you son of a bitch. Okay, yeah, look at us. Look at you go, man. You are. You are pissed off, boy. Oh, that just made him even angrier. Okay. Well then. Oh, God. That hurt. 
Hey, hey, what? He was down? I didn't even notice he was down. Man. Lame. 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 One more hit, you son of a bitch. Kill you. That's what you get. My character looks so sad. To die. Da, da, da. You're just too strong. Sorry, my friends. Once again, I have failed to protect you. But we don't want to attack your friends. She speaks the truth. We simply require your assistance. You seem strong enough to remove the boulder from my end bridge. The boulder? Why didn't you say so? But well, you attacked us first. Oh dear, I suppose so. Please forgive me. I only thought... Actually, I should be thanking you. After our encounters, I had a change of heart. Since I've lived alone for so long, I resolved to make some actual friends. I suppose humans aren't so bad after all. Ha ha ha. It's been ages since that whole ghost thing. Anyway, you're quite the looker for your age, ma'am. <laughs> if you have any tips for keeping your skin so smooth, I might be interested. Although, I'm not human, I'm starting to get these wrinkles in. Hey, I'm still young. Might we get back to the issue at hand? Cal's really upset that this guy is all talking smack about Rel. I want to find my people. Ergo, we have to cross that bridge. Dot dot dot. Sadly, I don't have the strength to do that. But you're a demon, aren't you? Yes. Then perhaps I could help you. Think of it as an apology for attacking you. We guardians are able to harness mana. Mana? My dad mentioned that once. Some kind of natural energy. You find it in all living things, but it's dangerous in large doses. Yes, that's right. They say it's possible to increase a demon's strength using mana. How about I give you mine? Really? It's the least I can do. You got mana. With the extra A. Natural life energy guaranteed 100% sustainable, blah blah blah. It is done. I hope it helps you. Now leave. I need to rest for a spell. That fight wore me out. It's been ages since I swam that much. May I, maybe I should start exercising more and lose a little weight. So, Jatai is a guardian too. Like the one we faced in the forest in my time. I wonder if they're somehow connected to the mag Magi. Did you catch that Mega Clink? We must locate the person who will help us use this mana. Alright, later, bro. <laughs> One last time. Ah, I can't save. Hey. If you're looking for the boss, I'm afraid he's had it. You already said this. Come on. I just got on talking to your boss. I wonder if there's another way out of here. Guess not. No sirree, Bob. Alright, gents. It was nice uh, hanging out with you. I'm leaving your spooky ass forest now. Yeah, let's get going.
So I'm guessing this lady can help us with the B, with the, uh, the mana. Ah, oh, what a fine young man you are. Hope you brought me the good stuff. Let's give her some mana. What do you want me to do with that, my B of G9000? What can I do for you, darling? Wake an ally? First, I can only proceed with awakening if you bring me enough mana. Ah, okay. Mana's that life energy. Alright. Okay. Oh, wonderful. You dug up some mana. Let's start off with this beefy one. We'll make an ideal test subject. Upgrading powers. Cal's power has reached level 2. You can focus longer to unleash a more powerful attack. Okay. Alright. What can I do for you, darling? Nothing. See you soon, my rubber ducky. <laughs> that old lady. Oh my gosh. Alright, here we go. It is on. Like Donkey Kong. I need to focus more in order to break the boulder. What? I thought it was maxed out. Ah. Oh, okay. Oof. Oh my. You shall pass. I just removed it. Ah, I just removed it and their dialogue didn't change. Yeah. Look at me, I'm swimming in the cash. 1230 G's. Oh, look at this pink little guy. He's all... He's not pink anymore. He was pink and he was very upset. Oh my. He's like a metal slime. When he's red, he's all like, no damage. Whoa, hello. Ah, what is that crap? That mushroom's all farting stuff, I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is quite out of hand, if you ask me. Alright, what do we got? Ooh, this is spooky. Look at this. Pyramid of the Prophet. Very, very spooky. Spooky, spooky. Taiko! Look! Look at that! Oh my. What happened here? Where's my village? My parents? My friends? Everything's gone! There's a little cloud coming. He's a happy little cloud. I had my suspicions, but now I'm sure of it. This isn't our time period. We have to find out what happened. Let's try Genova. Somebody there should be able to tell us. Is this Genova? Yep. What is this? Sierra Harbor. There's a ship! What else do we have? Windy Valley. You are now entering the great trade capital, Genova. Be sure not to make any trouble, and we'll ensure your safety. Traitors and disciples. Traitors and disciples. All day long, all I see are traitors and disciples. It's crazy. Has everyone really become a traitor or a disciple? I mean, apparently, that's what you're telling me. Wow, it's like they're making out. You just got to Genova, right? It's obvious from your tan. You spent too much time outdoors. In Genova, my delicate skin is protected from the sun's harmful rays by the vapors of the smug. Yeah.
I just want to steal everything, but I can't steal anything. I can't seem to find my key to the library, but I'm certain I left it here. I simply must find it to continue my study of the scientific explanation from the predominance of traders in an econo-religious system within a post-disaster society. Now where has Mimi gone? Where has Mimi gone? Still hanging around with her friends, I suppose? Well, as long as she stays out of trouble and lets me work. Now where is that blasted key? If I find your key, I'm still in your shit. Alright, I think I'm gonna call this. I'm gonna maybe stream later on tonight, but uh, I'm gonna take a break, get some, I don't know, Something to eat at least. I don't really know what. At least a snack, maybe. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching, and uh, have a good one.